Good morning, children. How are you all? Good morning, Hello, sir. sir. Students, we are going to learn mango buds. Mango buds. This is the first chapter. Once upon a time in a forest, there was a small cluster of mango trees. In the spring, its branches were covered with beautiful mango blossom and the forest echoed with the happy buzzing of honeybees. Soon the flowers fell and in their place, small mangoes began to appear. So let's learn the meaning. Once upon a time in a forest, there was a small group of mango trees. The meaning of cluster is group. In the springtime, the branches of the mango trees were covered with beautiful mango flowers and the forest echoed with the happy buzzing of honeybees means honeybees used to buzz all over the forest. Soon the flowers fell and in their place small mangoes began to appear. Sun grew hotter and the mangoes grew bigger. Slowly they turned golden yellow. When the trees were full of juicy mangoes, people and animals came to eat the delicious fruit. So soon the flowers fell down and in their place small mangoes began to appear. The sun grew hotter and day by day the mangoes also grew bigger. Slowly they turned into juicy and tasty yellow fruits. So when the trees were full of juicy mangoes, people and animals from all over the place came there to eat the tasty fruit. Now let's look at the picture. Hmm, the mango forest is looking very nice and many people along with animals are there who are enjoying the lovely and tasty mangoes. Enjoy yourself, eat as much as you like but leave some for others. Are the trees talking to us? Yes, people said that there was a tree god who protected the forest and it was his voice. Everyone who heard the voice obeyed it. So everyone is enjoying the tasty and delicious mangoes. All of a sudden someone said, Enjoy yourself, eat as much as you like, but leave some for others. So two boys were there who thought that the tree god was talking to them. So people said that there was a tree god who protected the forest and it was his voice. Everyone who heard the voice obeyed it. Now let's look at the next part. What happened next? One day a man came with a big sack. Inside it was a smaller bag. He climbed a mango tree and began to pluck the mangoes and fill the bag. So one day from a different place a man came with a big sack. Sack means with a big bag. Inside it was a smaller bag. He climbed a mango tree and began to pluck the mangoes and fill the bag. The man did not listen. So the man did not listen to the tree god. He kept plucking the mangoes. When his bag was full, he emptied it into the sack and climbed another tree to pluck more mangoes. So the man started plucking all the mangoes from the trees. Now the tree god was asking, Will you eat the mangoes alone? They are for all, not just for you. So the tree god told him not to eat so many things. He even asked, will you eat the mangoes alone? So the tree god asked the man if he would eat all the mangoes alone. The tree god said, they are for all, not just for you. So now the man starts thinking, how strange, how can this happen? All of a sudden we can see in the picture that the mango sack fell down and all the mangoes started popping out from there. 
and you can see also that all the mango started moving out from the sack so students that's all for today students i really hope that you have liked the story so that's all for now thank you so much bye bye